Where are we going this weekend? We are going to Cork. Uh, that's where the Blarney Stone is, where if you kiss it, you're supposed to have good language and something. I'm not actually quite sure. Um, it's on the southern side of uh, Ireland. The next stop we'll have to, will be Belfast, trying to get all four corners of the island. We found a place that's like 40 minutes outside of uh, Cork. It's like an animal sanctuary, so they have like a little, it's like a little glamping spot. We like to get out of the city uh, when we can, so that'll be nice. So it's about like 25 bucks a person to get a train ticket there, and then there are 25 bucks to get them back, so. About $50 to travel from Dublin to Cork by train. Yeah. Currently running to the bus stop, or to the train station. We are running at the train station because we have a train to Cork at 8 a.m. Running just a bit behind. Gaelic, English. Thank you. Made it. I definitely see dead people. What are you gonna do, Ian? What am I gonna do? I'm gonna get on this bus. to get a taxi. For Ian. <laughs> Look at this Airbnb. This is nuts. Okay, bedroom, kitchen sink, microwave, Bathroom, wow. If you look, you can see the wolves. Uh, we are in the countryside near Kilworth, about an hour outside of Cork. In a glamping animal sanctuary. And I gotta say, pretty impressed because there are wolves, like right there, lemurs, a whole bunch of animals. So it's gonna be a, a, a very exciting weekend, that's for sure. Definitely the smallest Airbnb I've ever been in, but it is by far the coolest. That is a double rainbow. First night in the animal sanctuary. We have a talking raven. We have wolves. Do you hear that? That was a talking raven. Hello, Francis. Hello, Francis. Hello, Good job. Good job, buddy. Wolf enclosure. Where we're sleeping. Do I find the best Airbnbs? Oh, do I find the best Airbnbs or what? You do. That is an Irish wolfhound. And the cool thing about an Irish wolfhound is they are one of the oldest breeds of dogs in existence. Just for a size comparison, it's a pretty big dog. No, <laughs> 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 Right now we're in a 
place outside of Kilworth and we're headed to a waterfall. We're gonna check it out. Apparently it's super beautiful, great for pictures. So I'm gonna go over there and hopefully get some amazing photos. Been hiking now for a couple hours. I'm just kidding. It's been like 15 minutes. What a model. About trail size. Yes. It's very small, big enough for about one car to come and drive down. This is a Toyota. And I can bet you almost anything, it still runs. Okay, so something that we see a lot um, are these walls. So it looks just like a hedge. Um, and as we walk, we'll go through. But you can see that these are rocks. Um, and all of this was rock at one point, and it still is. It's just buried beneath years and years of growth and vegetation. Finally got to the waterfall. This is where we're gonna turn around. It's our lunch spot. It's the place we wanted to come to. So we finally made it here. It's beautiful. It's about an hour hike from the Airbnb, which is perfect if you wanna take a nice long walk. You can pack a lunch, you can come to the waterfall, and then you go back to the animal sanctuary, which is just super ideal. saying goodbye. How was your trip? It's good. I don't feel sad to leave. Always living a home. It's true.